And you wonder why nobody wants to fool with you. You wonder why you can't seem to catch a break. And as my voice penetrates through your speakers, I can see you looking around as if to say, is he talking to me? Yeah, I'm talking to you. I'm all up in your personal space. I'm all up in your living room. I'm all up in your eardrums. I'm all up in your life. Because you don't get it. Your personal brand sucks. The personal brand of you is faulty. It's whack. Less than desirable. And you don't even know. That's the crazy part. See, the brand of you is always on display. Your personal brand is what people are saying about you when you're not around. And I'm not talking about your haters because we all know haters go hate. They don't count. I'm talking about people with absolutely no bias. These people are neutral. And when your name comes up, are they saying things like, no, don't fool with that person. They are not gonna get the job done. They are not gonna be on time. They are gonna lie. You can't trust them as far as you can throw them. Or when your name comes up, are people saying like, good people. I would trust them with anything. I've worked with them. I've spent time with them. And they are solid, solid as a rock. Do you know the personal brand of you? I better yet, do you know the facial expression associated with the personal brand of you? And what I mean by that is, when your name comes up, what facial expression does the other person give off? Is it like, ooh, or is it like, yeah? Which one are you? Are you a, ooh, or are you a smile? Because it's keeping it 1,000 no matter what. Your brand is always on display. And some of you continuously disrespect your brand without even thinking about it. That's the bad news. The good news is, once you understand and realize that you are a brand, no matter what's going on, no matter what's happening, you can start making the necessary changes. Now, see, you've already been labeled by some people, so it may take a little bit of work for them to believe and accept the newly branded version of you. But we see it in the real world. Big business, big companies like Uber, Chipotle, Dunkin' Donuts experienced setbacks with their brand. And they went in and revised and re-strategized and made the necessary changes and adjustments and reintroduced the world to their new brand and now they're sitting back on top. You can do the exact same thing. You just have to understand that every move that you make, every step that you take, somebody is watching, somebody is assessing, somebody is judging. And ultimately, that's how the brand of you is determined. So make sure you're promoting the brand that you want the world to see. Let excellence be your brand. Because when you're excellent, you become unforgettable. The brand of you is super important. And when your brand is right, your life is right. And when your life is right, you find yourself climbing over the hump and making each and every day of your life a Wednesday. Respect your personal brand because it is the brand called you. This is a great day to win. Let's go.